Four years ago, I was inspired by John from the YouTube channel Hounds of Howgate to walk the Cape Wrath Trail. After turning 65 at the end of July 2023, I embarked on my 18-day attempt to join these other intrepid hikers. So join me as I drag my old body over 4x4 tracks, single tracks, pathless tracks, bogs, midges, river crossings and all the weather elements Scotland has to offer. Well that's it folks, this is it. Next uh, we're going to get the minibus, it takes one hour to do seven and a half miles, the road's really rickety and poor. And then uh, there's a little ferry boat and it just takes us across the other side and it's a two mile walk into Dunness. So here we go, Cape Wrath baby. Cape Wrath, what a way to leave it. What a gorgeous day. Just amazing, amazing. Okay, let's get finalise this. Oh, I actually see there's some machinery down here too. Noticed that before. First day of dry feet. <laughs> Amazing. This is a foghorn here. So, uh, this is a foghorn. Look at the view up the coast. And uh, these are the compression tanks. <laughs> these are actually fed um, in the main building uh, back there. There's uh, diesels and uh, there's a massive compressor. That was actually pre that was pretty good, dude. And uh, there's actually a bus just came in for a day visitor, so which comes from the nest to the lighthouse. So we can see it. Don't fall! Don't fall! <laughs> and uh, this is a cliff straight off the edge here. So uh, I should actually show you around. See that? And it's right here. Yeah, it's right here. The wall is down. Walk along here. So it's round here. There's um. It's quite steep, nicely my system, not like this. But uh, if you actually stand here, you can have the edge here. storms. Oh, they'll be happy. This is Carol's last day here, driving the minibus. There you go, my man. He managed to put up with my sense of humour. He, really. he told me to shut up earlier. He hasn't let him speak. Here's the two Czech girls. I'm going to put, the, I'm going to put down the window and say, so we're full. You have to walk, right? <laughs> I see her face. It's Barbara. Barbara, but the, uh, Barbara. But, but what's that? That's your bus. Are you looking for seats? Please. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's too funny. Hey. Did you enjoy your stay? Yeah, it was wonderful. Good. Uh, do we fit in with the rucksacks as well? <laughs> Look at the state of this. Fashven. 
this is actually only 1500 feet. I never see it, it looks 1500 feet. And this area is called Inshore. Inshore. You've got Lock Inshore. Amazing. So for paragliding, this is like paragliding heaven, guys. You can actually you can fly anywhere here. Fly anywhere here. Fantastic. Not too bad, eh? <laughs> so this is a 70-year-old Andy cycling. We saw him last night, obviously, right? He's got his camel bag. He's got his camel bag. Snows like a trooper. We've got a couple of bikers, <laughs> a lovely married couple, <laughs> a couple of Czechs, the ferry man. <laughs> we got these guys from the Wirral, <laughs> and these are more motors than we've we'll got. Uh, we'll get my partner Pete and I here. Now <laughs> <laughs> we get uh, Carol, the bus driver man. Awesome. What a way to end a three-week holiday. Oh man, that's just, just <laughs> fantastic, man. It's fantastic. Just absolutely fantastic. That's a great stuff to enjoy, man. I'm just heading over to Durness now. <laughs> ah, humour. Humour, best thing I can ever go. Oh, there's a bus stop here. Must be a bus. Cool. Oh, I never paid the guy! Jesus! Yeah. This is the campground. The tent's over here. My tent's over here. And uh, if you look around, just look at this campground's setting. Actually, like this campground. The motorhomes galore here. <laughs> but, uh, what the beach looks like. You can set your set up your cam camper van just completely overlooking the beach. Well there's a walk up to the The other side, so around this peninsula. Ah, oh, look at this beach boat. A fair old wind to see there. Inverness now, and uh, I was just about to go over the Kessock Bridge. 